Tekken 7 is without a doubt one of the best fighting games in the market, but its online issues could be its undoing. Stick around for more info on this. Bandai Namco's Tekken 7 has been our go-to fighting game ever since it came out. We have been avid fans of the franchise ever since the first installment of the game appeared on the original PlayStation. What we like most about the series is the fact that Bandai Namco decided to stay true to the simple yet awesome Tekken gameplay formula. This essentially means that if you've played any of the previous editions of Tekken, you will have no problems taking on your opponents in Tekken 7 and beating them to a bloody pulp, especially when you consider the fact that most of the fan favorite characters are part of this game's roster as well. However, as much as we like the fact that the core gameplay mechanics have remained the same, we have to admit that even though Tekken 7 is our favorite brawler, it does get a bit stale offline. So naturally, we decided to invest our time in the online part of the game, which is where the real fun is at, or rather, it's where the real fun should be at. Namely, Tekken 7 is still absolutely riddled with online issues. Back in June 2017, we reviewed Tekken 7 and we stated that pretty much the only downside of the game game were its online issues. Now it's December 2018 and the same problems still persist. Finding an online match, ranked or casual, is incredibly frustrating as it takes ages to find an opponent. It took us well over 20 minutes to find an online match on one occasion. And if you get lucky, if you do find an opponent fairly quick, do not be surprised if you see a disconnect message right after the opponent found screen. This has happened to us way more times than we can count. We tried finding a match with loads of different settings so we could rule out any potential connection problems on our end, despite the fact that no other game lags on our system and we still experience the same thing. Even though Bandai Namco did introduce a patch to resolve the online issues back in 2017, it seems that the problem is in need of a much bigger fix than just a mere patch. The online tournament mode is indeed very interesting and fun and would arguably be the game's biggest selling point in terms of online play if it weren't for the aforementioned troubles which unfortunately rendered this mode damn near unplayable. Though it doesn't take long for people to join and create brackets for the tournament, it takes one player with bad connection to kick you all out of the session even if the tournament is already long underway. You can only imagine the frustration you feel when you manage to fight your way to the finals just to get randomly disconnected because of the game's poor servers. This is truly a shame because the tournament offers a variety of different modes that do a great job of evening out the playing field for hardcore and newbie players alike. Tekken 7 is an absolute masterpiece of a fighting title. It's a game that simply deserves to be enjoyed online as it has so much to offer. We really hope that Bandai Namco sort these issues out and give the players the satisfaction of becoming the champion of Iron Fist Tournament 7. However, for the time being, we'll have to stick to fighting offline, but we will keep an eye out on the online mode in case the problem gets resolved. If that happens, we'll gladly let you know. But tell us what you guys think about this. Have you been having the same problems with with online matches in Tekken 7 or has your experience been a smooth one? Let us know in the comments section below and please make sure to head over to alcar.com for much more content like this. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Thanks a lot for watching, this is Sobriel and see you in the next video.